Hi guys, today I'm going to be showing, um, just kind of walking you through the process of how I made my Christmas cards this year. So I made six, seven stars actually. The first one is this reindeer cutout. So the papers are from Craft Cellar. This is from last year. This is this year. Scandinavian, very nice. Um, all the Happy Christmas stamps I use our Happy Christmas from sorry, Inca Stamp UK. That's the number. Um, the sequins are Gutterman, and the reindeer is just a wood veneer I had, so I traced it onto some paper, cut it out, stuck it onto the paper, and then just did some layering. So that's the first card. Second card. I used this die that came with a Do Crafts magazine for the snowflakes. Um, the Gutterman sequins again, the same sentiment, and the craft setter paper in the back. So that's the second card design. The, card, the third card design is, I don't know, it's one of my favourites, that's for sure. Um, I gold embossed the Happy Christmas with, I think it's English stamp gold embossing, then just blue cardstock, put the snowflakes in a row and stuck it on. Very simple but I think very effective. My fourth card is probably my favourite. Yeah, I think it is. Um, so I used this stamp, Little Red Robin. That's the number um some do cross paper mania so I basically watercolored it some of them I used pro markers but the watercolor turned out better um I did happy Christmas I know the stem kind of fell off so I had to remount it and it was all crooked and everything then I used just these little stamps I have I cut a circle in some paper and layered it on. Um, honestly, I didn't have any acetate to make a shaker card, as I would have. So that's the fourth card, I think. The fifth card is very simple, but I really like it. It's using Feathered Friends Collection from creative card ma a magazine so th these are the stamps they're very nice you can back order them clear impressions it's called um, yeah. so I basically stamped it watercolored it then with um, Uniball Signo marker I used this for quite a lot of snow here as well I did on the lines make some snow, added some sequins. I also added some ribbon. So this is the tree designs I have. Melarina. That's the ribbon I used. Um the craft center paper again. And that's very nice. The next one is using the owl so you can see the branch is considerably longer here. I just extended it a bit with a uh, Staedtler pigment liner. Um, I watercolored it using Ducraft's markers. I'll get them show you. Using these watercolor dual tip pens, I'm reviewing them on my channel. And I used these snowflakes I had and the craft seller paper again just watercolor the background um, embossed it in white do craft embossing powder so that's that card the last card is one my probably second favorite um, for the edge detailing I used this First Noel set from Ducrafts. First Noel borders, it's called. 
get five borders, they're very nice. I used this one, which is the thickest. So I stamped some green ink and just layered it onto the paper. Um, die cut a circle, and then I used these two stamps, layered him onto that to do that. Coloured it in with watercolours. This is from Craft Cellar. All the papers are from Craft Cellar. Then the Gutterman sequins and the pen again. So those are my cards. I'll show them again in greater detail. So this is the first card. Next one. The next one. The next one. The, I love this one as well. The detailing. This one. This one. And this one, my favourite. So thanks for watching. Please like, comment and subscribe. Have a Merry Christmas. Bye.